morning to everybody. Our gospel for this morning is from John chapter 20 verse 11 to 18. Mary Magdalene stayed outside the tomb weeping and as she wept she bent over into the tomb and saw two angels in white standing there, one at the head and one at the feet where the body of Jesus had been. And they said to her, Woman, why are you weeping? She said to them, They have taken my Lord, and I do not know where they laid him. When she, when she had said this, she turned around and saw Jesus there, but did not know it was Jesus. Jesus said to her, Woman, why are you weeping? Whom are you looking for? She thought it was the gardener, and said to him, Sir, if you carried him away, tell me where you laid him, and I will take him. Jesus said to her, Mary. She turned and said to him in Hebrew, Rabuni, which means teacher. Jesus said to her, Stop holding on to me, for I have not yet ascended to the Father. But go to my brothers and tell them, I am going to my Father and to your Father, to my God and to your God. Mary went and announced to the disciple, I have seen the Lord and then reported what he told her. Beloved, the gospel of the Lord. We shall be quiet in a moment, going through the reading ourselves and asking God to speak to us before he asked me also to share with you some few words. Arise, Catholic faithful, rejoice and renew. Once again, we have the opportunity to hear the gospel that narrates the events of the resurrection as experienced by Mary of Magdala. If you have noticed, the resurrection story initially begins with Mary Magdalene. She is the woman who goes to the tomb, who looks for Jesus, who goes to do nothing else than to worship him, to have a first encounter with the Lord. See, I share about a friend of Mary Magdalena. You say, Oh, sorry, no more summoning in Ara. I can't send P. Fano, said the Anopa two two two, or caught in Nanoso. A quarter shed Jesus, said your bet to me, and then no Asia and Punimpu, said your obet to me, and then in Sasonimo, 
said you obey to me a hunu no wasumuno. That is all that Easter is about to experience the resurrection of Christ and the power of the resurrection. Mary Magdalene today goes to the tomb as we read from the Johannine version today. Yesterday we re read from Matthew. Today we read from John. All the gospels narrate different experiences of Mary's encounter with Jesus at the tomb. Sometimes when we are overcome by what we desire, we fail to concentrate on the truth. For Mary, for Mary, she was so much bent on seeing Jesus that even when she saw Jesus, she considered him for a gardener. Sometimes I heard, and sadly so, when I was much, much younger, somebody asked me, why is it that Jesus says Mary should not hold on to him? Is it because Mary was not pure? Is it because Mary, is it because she was a woman? Or is it because maybe she was in a monthly flow? Or is it because this or that? My dear brother, my dear sister, why do you read into scripture things that have not been said? Is it that those things are deep into your head and are preventing you to see the simple truth? No. If she was a woman and she cannot see Jesus, why is she standing there with Jesus? If she was in a monthly flow, she has already been given the opportunity. And who says that a woman in her monthly flow is not pure? If she is merely a woman, it is she who has become the apostle to the apostles. So nobody must see anybody as not being qualified to talk to Jesus. Everybody is qualified as long as you are willing. Etom rebia, ye mubi etumi ebise bisa ye hon ensembi. Na ye na. Em rebia yukrem a chapa. Ebi mubi sa mi question. Se fada. Aninti na Mary Magdalene. Jesus kachira ni se. Men so mimu. Adain. Oyo ba aninti ana. Ebi kwa se. Anase bia. Na nebusu mi asu inti ya. Inti na ibi ya na moja na eitu ni inti no. Neche se nuhu enti. Inti ujidi se. O nipa ebe tumi. Bo nipa tumi ya wo nipa hon se. So de nisa so jises mua. Jises mube ye fi ya na. Nenya di bon ya fuwa ene ko o nyami ho. Inti si so ampa se nka nuhu aye fi ya. Anase nka nuhu enti ya. Enye nipa ni honti eno ko jises wa na. Ani nti na ye mubi etumi ye ya jini se. Obi we, mami we ni honti. Papa we ni honti. E busyan we yi debi. We mu diye debi. Ani nti na omu ben nyami. Ani nti na omu ben sofu no. Ani nti na omu diye omu yese yi. Ani nti na sofu e yi omu se omu nyese. Ma yi mwene sa. O nyami yi wa, nu we yi u. E mfa hon ni ya wye. E bi kwa wye de bon ye ni ti se Mary Magdalene. Ne mou nou nyame e de nensa e de akan. Ni e hon hiyan e ne se. Jesus e ma no e tu mi akwenya. E ma ono susu e tu mi ben e no. What is necessary today for you and I to focus is that Jesus says that do not hold on to me physically, but hold on to me spiritually. Do not look at me with your physical eyes. Look at me with your spiritual eyes. Do not hold on to me on this earth but hold on to me in heaven because I am going to your father. I am going to your God and my God. So what I learn for today is that let us stay at the tomb with all our hearts and we will see Jesus. During this period of lockdown, you have all the time 
to stay at the tomb. Seek for Jesus until you have seen him. And when you see him, make a message to somebody. Remember, this week is the week that I have told you. Too many forwarding. You see this forward. You see that forward. Even things that are not true, forward, forward, forward. Why do we do that? Let us send our own experience. And the internet acquired to say, Obi send you Bibia, say ya no cre, say ya no cre. Send you Pacrona, send the other man one, and also so shall it say, hm, cream, no one send it. A bra won't you any home? A bra one cassa won't be some who say, Now me and Cassa Suno, me to me, mean to me and Trom Indiana. What's him in Tibrofo? What's him in Tichi? What's him in him said the American? What you said you wouldn't him said the Akambia, say in your Miss Samuno, Conner Cocker. Nanyami ebe fa aye kese Mary Magdalene or your ba onko suku eh friend say Jesus Christ or the nigga say train and so so wo koko ka kire esuafo ne se me hu awurade no na sey no ka kire me na muntie enne wo so so awurade e twen wo se wo betumi akowi ase akoka kire obi ne awurade aya ma wo God is wait the world is waiting for you for you also to send them your experience, your experience. This will be our song. Niawa ya mami dosu. Niawa ya mami esumi bo. Nei frima kumem. Any margin in a Mika say me da wasi. Oh, Niawaya, mami, a dosu radi. Oh, Niawaya, mami, a sum me bo. Ne free ma kumem. Any margin in a O mi kase mi dawasi. At this moment, we want the world to encounter Jesus. We want the world to encounter Jesus. And the power of Jesus bring healing into the world. The power of Jesus bring healing into the world. The world that has been put on its knees right now. That Jesus, the great healer, he who said, I have come, that the world may have true healing, that we would know the Lord. Let us pray right now, everybody. Children, adults, all of us, male and female, let us pray that Lord heal our land and heal our world right now. Sayan Yare, Eradi Sayan Yare, Eradi Fonsaka Assassin, Eradi Adima and in Kuala and in Penny for the Mamma at the Shawnsa, Eradi Adia Sorry and near Sorima at the Shawnsa, Eradi Eviasi and Akoko Shedem you, Eradi Adia Nenina de Shawnsa, a doctor for Ebre, a necessary for Ebre, Eradi Womabri and the Ewu, Sano Pendomi, yes, Bot and Paya, sir, Mabi Biera, Eradi Bowenime, Mampai Boya. We pray this morning unto you that Lord your world shall know the healing, shall know that the healing comes from you. Oh divine master, oh divine Jesus, oh divine Holy Spirit, hear our prayer. Hear our prayer as we come unto you right now. As we come unto you right now. As we come unto you right now, as we pray, invite. Them. Thank you all for your prayer for the meeting. God bless, bless you, you Father. Bye.